Assalamualaikum. I am Nur Shaira Winti Shamsuddin. My final year research project title is Financial Integration Between Malaysian Sukup and China's Bond Market Using Multivariate Gauge Analysis. So this is the presentation outline. So I will go to the introduction. Sukup is an Islamic bond and it is one of financial certificate. It is known as Sharia Compliant Bonds. A bond is a fixed income instrument which represents a loan to a borrower made by an investor. Sukup represents an ownership to the asset while bond represents a debt obligation. So the problem statement, Islamic bonds are gaining attention from all over the world. This is because Islamic bonds follow Sharia compliant. There are no riba and gara. Besides that, Islamic bonds such as Sukuk has fixed interest rate. Chinese investor want higher return, lower correlation and growth potentiality. Chinese investors want to minimize the risk in investment so they seek diversification opportunities in financial integration of Malaysian Sukuk and China's bond market. The objective of study is to investigate whether Sukuk offer any advantages in terms of global diversification. The literature review, according to College Time 2017, Sukuk enjoy liquidity greater than their traditional counterparts. College Time said this aspect reduced the risk of liquidity as investors decide to sell their holdings. Research carried out by Sati et al. 2017 entitled Financial Integration Between Sukup and Bond Indices of Emerging Market Insight from Wavelet, uh, Wavelet Coherence and Multivariate Gauge Analysis conclude that Sukup market offers effective portfolio diversification opportunities for fixed income investor. Uh, research carried out by Samsudin et al. 2017 entitled Predicting the Inflation Rate in Malaysia using, using Sukup Term Structure conclude that Sukup Term Structure is better to forecast the inflation rate. So the methodology First, the data were collected from investing.com and Yahoo Finance. Then, by using Microsoft Excel, plot, uh, plot the graph and find the volatility and correlation. So, this is the gauge uh, equation. This is the standard residue. Uh, taken from the first stage and added as input to measure a matrix of correlation which varies in time. So this is the equation. Next is the likelihood of ECC estimator. And finally is the standard return were employed by angle 2002. So we go to the result. Uh, from the graph, we can see that um, Van Advertis China AMC China Bond ETF, or we call it C Bond, has uh, the return was up and down, while M Dynamic Sukup shows the return was down at initial but maintained constant after that. So from the Microsoft Excel, we can find the volatility for the C bond and M dynamic. Both bonds have low volatility. And the correlation between C bond and M dynamic also have low correlation. So, from the result, this research can be concluded that C bond and M dynamic sukup can offer effective diversification opportunity for fixed income China investor investors because it has low volatility and low correlation between these two bonds. So the risks were low between these two bonds and the correlation uh, is low so it will help the investor to diversify the asset. So these are the reference. That's all. Thank you.